move solo cause it feels safer Astronaut, I move solo cause it feels safer. Fake friends and fake people, some of them is hate Fake friends and fake people, some of them is haters still see like some grime. I mean, I had like really small wire brushes. I had all, uh, where is it? I had this junk, something small where it wouldn't like, you know, scratch up the wheel. Like you can see, like it obviously would have been stupid to use this if I planned on keeping this color. But I thought I was killing two birds with one stone cause um, you know, I don't, there's not a lot of road rash. So I thought to myself, if I could just get off the clear coat without really obstructing the, the, uh, the surface of the rim, then I was like, you know, I really could just do a light sand and then lay the paint down. So, uh, I tried, man. I tried getting everything off. It's just the way the rim is set up, man. It's, you can see it's still coming off. And I'm just like, I don't know what the hell to do, man. I mean, I'm trying. But if it's going to take me all day, you know what I'm saying? I was only going to, I definitely don't know if I'll get all four done, man. But, uh, yeah. I mean, I'm trying. All right, so uh, I had to fast forward a lot of video recording because uh, for one, the bumper completely, like I completely fucked that shit up. And I thought, let's just go walk over there real quick. So basically, uh, I don't know how to just stand still and wait. So I wound up painting another coat while it was still wet on a day where it is fucking raining. So, you know what I'm saying? I was like, all right, I'm gonna just step away from it, sand it down um and all that so at that point i was like i can't be recording looking dumb so i said let me just sand it down try to paint over um the bumper wasn't really in good condition for real i mean you got oh shit you got that it's like you'll see when it dries but it's a couple of imperfections i want to call it but uh you know i gotta improve with painting so i'm not really you know too crazy about it. i mean i'm keeping the car i love the car i mean so any little fuck ups that i have i'll just go back and do it again you know but uh yeah i don't know if you could even see it right now you can probably see a little bit of the split i just gotta sand it all over again but yeah but that's what's going on and uh same the wheels are good actually i actually did a really good job on the wheels uh when it dries you'll see oh uh, this is the paint that i used so i was uh looking on youtube i forgot exactly which video but if i find it before i upload this episode um i'll put the link but this is the what i use for the wheels really good paint you know it really sits well um it dries quickly uh the main important thing with with stuff good stuff like this is just the sanding i mean as long as it's smooth to the touch i can assure you that this will have a nice smooth surface like i'm not even a professional and it really did its number for me you know what i'm saying i went inside 
I went outside, you know, that good stuff. So, uh, you know, when they dry up, what I was going to do is I was going to put a wax over it um, so it can kind of protect the paint. So we'll, we'll see what happens when we get there. I had them out here, uh, went and did a quick Instacart joint. I was like, I was waiting for the paint to dry on the bumpers and the wheels. So I'm like, I'm gonna go ahead and chill, see if we busy all. Um, Tuesday and Wednesday is like the slowest days of the week. So I didn't really expect much. This this one is uh, 14, like 1407, 10 items, two mile drive. So I was like, shit, I might as well take it. Man, I know for a fact I'm gonna have to repaint this bumper, yo. I'm just glad the wheels came out okay, you know what I'm saying? I gotta get tired. Mm -hmm. Crazy, Man, I ain't gonna lie to you, though. So the lower part of the rear bumper is like... Fucked up beyond repair. It's crazy. I bought some reflector lights that don't even fit. So, you know, I was going to try to modify it. I was going to try to modify the bumper so the lights could fit. And uh, so, as I'm trying to fit it, I noticed, I guess because my car's low. So, uh, you know, going up driveways and stuff. The curve in the bottom part of the rear bumper, it's got like, it's been rubbed down so much, it's basically holes. Like, I could put my hand through it. So, Oh, you know what I'm saying? I was like, I don't even know if I should put that back on the car. At least right now. I mean, I haven't seen anything online. I mean, I seen one on eBay for four hundred dollars for the lower part. I'm like, what the fuck? I could probably just find that joint on or Craigslist. So I'm gonna see how it looks with the top half. And if it don't look that great, then I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure that out. I mean, I really don't want to put that back on the car. Like, it looks crazy as hell. And it would look even crazy. Like, I ain't even a professional painter, so that's me painting over some bullshit. But I can't wait to see the uh, wheels go, man. That's gonna be a real good look. Too much, man. Bro hurt a little bit. I ain't got no COVID, though. You know what's crazy? I've had this thing with buds with weed, like. I don't know. I still gotta figure it out, I guess. It's like, I don't know. When I get high or when I'm intoxicated, like, it puts me in this crazy space of comfort. And it's like, you know, to the point where you just kind of want to sit down and not really do shit all day or. You know, long story short, you want to avoid work. So it's like I've been uh, slowing down moderately. And it's crazy. Like, I ain't never really smoked that much. But I've always, you know, I guess at least until I moved down to Virginia, I started surrounding myself with people who smoke, like, all the time. And it's crazy because, like, I knew mad people who smoked up here. But it was like, I don't know. For some reason, I had it under control. But then I thought about it. And I'm like, you know... When I'm, when I'm in Virginia, you know what I'm saying? I got my own freedom, my own place. I got my own shit going on. So it was like, I get high and just look around and get comfortable. And I just be like, fuck it. But, you know, that shit not good. And it's like, I'm about to be 30 anyway. So I don't know how much longer I should even theoretically be smoking. Smoking weed or, you know, drinking anything. Like, I already don't eat meat. Like, I really need to focus on my health. You know what I'm saying? So I'm kind of just like taking it easy. Like, I had bought some uh, bud that wasn't, it wasn't really all that great, but it was good. But I'm pretty sure that's why my throat hurt. If I had some gas, I usually would be fun. Don't buy cheap weed, yo. Word. Where the hell am I going? I'm going to, uh, I'm going to clean. I know how to get clean. Yeah, man. So I've been, you know, working on me, trying to trying to get right, you know what I'm saying? Like, weed's good and all, but you got to have, you got to maintain that shit. And it, it's crazy because, like, the idea of it not being a bad substance for your body, a lot of people will over smoke and not even realize it because, you know, and they had it's good. But for some reason, I caught on. I was like, yo, I really feel, like, low-key lazy. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I don't know. Like, I can't get my shit right. If, you know, I'm going to be high all the time. And, you know, just because you're high don't mean you can't get your shit right. It's just I happen to be the nigga that can't balance both for some reason. I don't know. 
Front traction bug. I got that. I got uh, some rotors. I got like two parts that I bought on eBay. That, from what I'm learning, which I should have did my research, they're pretty useless without the sway bar, the rear sway bar, I should say. So, I guess I don't know if I put those in. Yeah, I got the coilovers. I had to, and I had to buy the top hats too. The only thing I'm missing right now is uh my drop You know what I'm saying? Um. I was gonna try to get those before I actually installed everything because uh, I don't know. That wishbone looks crazy, bro. Like it looked wild then and I feel like the way my suspension's been treating me, it's like it's all gonna go. So I don't know exactly how much it'll stand up to a brand new suspension, let alone one that's stiffer and everything. So I'll have to see. I'm gonna time this money, so Alright, what the hell am I going? Can you fuck me and hurt me? Alright, so, uh. I say you got damn right. Dang, what the hell's going on with the light? What the fuck? I fucked and hit in the yeah, head. So I got break. these for the uh, lugs and GM racing joints. I just wanted something locking. Got the lock, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and uh, throw one of these wheels on, see if we can get the look going. Know what I'm saying? I sure picked the right fucking day, man. So I only got three wheels done. Uh, this is the finished wheel. Uh, I'll go run real quick and show you the finished look. There we go. The embarrassment. The good wheel. And uh, I don't know about you guys, but I like the bumper. It could have been better, but I think for my skill set and for what I did, it's pretty good. But uh, yeah, we're going to jump on this shit tomorrow, man. I ain't going to get all soaked up. This is what I got going on with the first set of wheels. So I'm like I said, it's raining, so I can't really give you a dry pick today. Uh, I've been trying to dry them, but it keeps raining on and off. Uh, this is what I got going on with the JDM gold uh, lock and lug nuts. So, not for the embarrassing part. So, uh, this is pretty terrible. You can't see it from here, but I got a lot of streak marks. Um, again, I rushed. You know, when you rush, your job's not going to be done as much. But I was really trying to avoid the rain and the water. So I tried to make best with it. But chances are I'm going to just re-sand it, repaint it another time. On, I ain't going to spend all day going. So. Come on. Come on, B. Yeah, we back at the crib. Drop that joint off real quick. Easy order, too bad. Right. I know it's not full. I have this thing with me. I just when I'm in the zone, like I move too fast. Like I don't know how to slow down. Sometimes. Unless I know firsthand, I need concentration. Like for some reason, I don't know. I keep overlooking the fact that painting and sanding requires time and patience. Like I be treating painting bumpers like how I'm changing coil. You know what I'm saying? Like it's just a different art. And I, for some reason, in the midst of actually working, like, I overlook that, and I shouldn't, you know? Because, um, you know, there's certain things I miss. Like, I know I should have different types of sandpaper. Um, I should dry something thoroughly. I mean, I, I, for some weird reason, I decided to pick a rainy day to paint, but, you know, it's been raining so much, and I'm like, I gotta get stuff done, man. I can't just be sitting around. So I was like, fuck it, I'll shoot my shot. Clearly, it ain't matter because the rims are good, even though everything is wet, but it was dry when I did it.
street you talk and offending me often they don't believe you dead want to see you in your car i was going away in your face, invade your space, you act about to trade your place, how would I hold up, how long would I buy before I hold up? So, uh, okay, so I got some light, and I can see that those dots that you see are actually imperfections from the rain, obviously. So, uh, I'm just gonna paint another coating, um, and it said that, it you know, it would be 24 hours before I, well, one to two hours before you could touch, and then 24 hours before fully dry. So, if I just throw in another coat, um, on the wheels I did, I should be fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I just might be a sleeper, I just might be a dream, I just might be a worker, I just might be the king, I just might pull up and smoke with you and show you shit you ain't seen. I just might, motherfuckers better get it right, show you what we living like, look, it's crazy when you think about what could happen, so many ways we can look at it, really ain't trying to be taken backwards, and I got no time for these new actors, trying to get a role in this movie shit, in which I like to call my life, well I just might be the next number one nigga, not every move I make I think twice, and not only that I gotta think about price, not as far as money but the cost of my life. Cause right now I mean something This a 4-1 and my team coming Long as Kells got me, Jigga got me Daily got me, I'm straight Girl, they gave me a couple thousand Like young homie, just wait And I did that I told mama that I kid back And I'm going for everything I be fucking bitches to the wedding ring And I swear my wife gonna be a queen I just might take her to Rome Just might count a cool hundred thousand Right when I'm getting some dumb Like what the fuck am I on? Man, it's been a long time coming But I'm still running Trying to get straight to the top of this shit Oh, you think I be dropping this shit? I promise I really got love for this shit. I got love for the fans and I love taking pics. I got love for the bitches that love doing dick. I got love for the money that never will switch. I got love for the keys and that shout out to Mitch. Yeah. Yeah. We just might be the leaders of the whole free world. So, I, so I'm gonna paint them. I've painted these two already. I'm letting them dry in the sun. Um, I'm gonna paint the other two. I gotta clean. I didn't finish the one wheel. I didn't finish the one wheel, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna clean that and paint that. And uh, I think when I get my when I do my brakes, I order the brakes and stuff. I'm gonna take them off, resand them, and then uh, you know apply another coating. Uh, when they fully dry in 24 hours, what I was gonna do is I was gonna put a wax down, so it should make it look better. But I mean. I'm, I'm kind of like a perfectionist. That's why it kind of sucks that I'm not as good as paint. Got not as good with painting, but you know, a practice made perfect. So uh, I'm glad that at least I got the look down pack that I wanted. I'm just glad the wheels are black at this point. But uh, so boom. So and uh, the bumper was kind of trashed anyway. Like there's a huge hole right there that I can't seem to fucking. I don't know. Maybe it's just I don't want interest in really fixing. I got to get like putty and stuff like a filler but i'm going to re-sand the whole bumper i mean ain't much else i could do all right so this is the finished look right here um, i put a little bit of wax on it so it still needs um i definitely got to repaint it and i need brakes too so it's dust all over this shit I go hard cause the bread important. I go hard.